Hey guys, this is T.224 NYC with Stream Kings TV. I wanted to do a quick video tutorial of the newly updated Pulse build uh, for Kodi 17.3, 17.4, or essentially any version of Kodi Krypton that you guys are using. Um, I just re recently updated to um, version 17.4. Um, just being honest, I haven't seen any new features or noticed any performance issues. Um, with the new version of Kodi. Uh, some people have mentioned that um, EIM, the extended info mod that is, it's, it, that is available in some bills, um, is not working in 17.4, but I haven't currently come across that issue. So we'll quickly jump into the install of the new version or newly updated version of Pulse. Um, like I said before, it is available for download in the Aries Wizard. So to get there, Simply tap on the cogwheel, jump in the file manager. We're going to add source, click where it says none, type in http colon forward slash forward slash aries dash repo dot eu, and then go ahead and hit OK. And we're going to go ahead and give it a name, name it dot aries. Can't type today. And then go ahead and hit OK when you give it a name. Then go ahead and hit the back button. Then back again. Click add ons. Click the open box. Select the option to install from zip. Now, because um, this is a fresh install of Kodi, go into settings. Enable unknown sources, select the option for yes, hit back, select install from zip again, we're going to select .aries, click repository .aries project, and it'll take a couple of seconds, but there we go, the Aries add-on has been installed. Then you're going to select the option to install from repository. Select the Aries project. Program add ons. And the Aries wizard. Select the option to install. Once you get a pop up that says the add on is installed, just go ahead and click on Aries wizard again. And then select, select the option on the right to open the wizard. So Aries is going to take a moment to open. Once you're in Aries, select the option to browse bills. And Aries Wizard has, has a bunch of bills in here for you guys to install, but right now we're going to be looking at Pulse. Select Pulse. And now it's going to tell you to visit the website that's highlighted in yellow to obtain a PIN number. Now the website is a little bit hard to see. I think I have it here though, because I've been there before. So it's bit.ly forward slash build underscore pin. Okay, so our pin is 6112. We'll go back to Cody. Select enter pin. Punch in the pin that we just obtained, 6112. Select done.
Now here we're on the Aries page, so it'll tell you that you can only download the build five times in a 48 hour time frame. It also tells us that if you're on Jarvis, um, they're not updating it anymore. But we're looking for Cody CCM, I mean uh, Pulse CCM for crypto. So this week alone, this build has been downloaded over a million times, almost a million times, I should say. So this week, uh, they have uh, 822,242 downloads. I'm not too sure how accurate that is because today is Monday. So we're going to select the option to install. Now if you want to keep your favorites or add on settings etc you can do so but for this video I'm just going to leave it at the default settings and click proceed. And the build should quickly download for you. It's a smaller build for the most part, it's, um, but it does have a, a lot of add-ons. It's well laid out and it looks really well. It runs well on Fire Stick devices and lower spec um, Android boxes and Fire Sticks and that sort of thing. We're just looking for, I'm just pretty much looking for some alternatives since um, one of my favorite developers or Cody builders uh, Jason Diggs is not doing bills at the time, um, at, at this time, I should say. So this is definitely one to keep in the arsenal. If you're a Jason Diggs fan. And essentially, if, if any of the add-ons are not available for you guys in the Pulse build, um, you could always install the add-ons here. The add-ons that you want. But by far, this is one of the most popular bills that has come out as of late. Um, I've been using this, I think, probably for about the last three years or so. I've been using Pulse. All right, so the download is done. We're just extracting the data into, into the Kodi. And also coming soon, uh, the Stream Kings TV Cody build uh, will be available by the end of the month. So we are actually coming out with our own build. You know, we review these builds all the time and we see what some of the builds are, are lacking. And, um, you know, I've really been working hard on this thing. Finding a hosting site is, is, is a bit of an issue. I haven't um, figured that part of the process out as yet, but you definitely want to bring something new to the table because, you know, as far as bills go, you know, it's, it's very, very, very saturated. Um, it's probably, you know, hundreds of thousands of bills out there for you guys to use with your Cody. So, you know, I've pretty much, I've looked at a lot of them. I'm not going to say I've, I've even done, any, looked at a quarter of the bills. Um, let me keep this alive. But, you know, I definitely have my favorite developers. Um, so I will say that, you know, a lot of them have influenced some of the things that have, um, that I have coming in this build. But, you know, it, it, it is taking a little bit longer than I anticipated, um, between, you know, going to work, family, kids <laughs> you know I barely have time to upload videos to this YouTube channel to be honest but
All right, so it looks like we're about a third of the way there. Oh, and happy Labor Day weekend to you guys. Hope you, you and your families are having a good and safe extended holiday weekend. So we're just about done with the extraction. Uh, once it's done extracting, it's going to ask you, do you want to back up? Um, I'm going to say no for the purposes of this video. And I don't want to enter any free giveaways from Aries. And I select the option to close my coding. Now I'm going to go ahead and relaunch Cody. And as you can see, based on the RSS feed, this build was updated on August the 11th, going to let it update the add-ons here and we'll take off All right, here we go. So we start off in movies. Uh, we have uh, submenu Valhalla, TMPB, Bennu, Wolfpack, Picasso, Poseidon. They have uh, Fear, Fear of the Dark add-on, which is uh, all horror, fo horror fil films. Um, Not Sure and Stream Hub. Looks like we're still doing some updates here. Down below, the main add-ons are Elysium. Gerzel, of course Covenant, UK Turks, Stream Army, and Duckpool. Sports section. We got a kid section here as well. All in one section.
to have a live TV section as well. Also, the live TV is just okay. I mean, this build, I believe it's from the UK. So it's a heavy emphasis on um, live TV that's out of the country. I mean, of course, you can use these add-ons for basically anything. But a lot of these, uh, the main focus is UK TV. Have a system set section. Music. And TV shows. The one thing that I did want to point out about the most recent update is I noticed that the floating movie widgets are not loading on any of my devices. Um, I install this on a couple of, on a NVIDIA Shield, a Fire Stick, and a Fire Box, plus my PC just now with you guys. And you, if you see the picture of the television behind the screen, this is actually pretty cool because it changes. as you move from screen to screen but the one thing that's missing is these floating widgets here so hopefully they um, get that fixed on the next update uh, usually Pulse will update about once a month or so um, so I'm pretty sure they have an update coming uh, update coming really soon but overall minus the floating widgets a very very solid build simple build um, it's not a processor heavy build um, easy to use on the fire stick jam packed with add-ons I mean the add-on list is really really amazing just this main screen um, doesn't really shed the light of shed light on how many add-ons are really really included um, in this build I mean it's a really good amount of stuff So if you like this build, uh, this is the one to install, or this is the uh, the tutorial on how to install it. Um, don't forget to like the video, guys, and uh, go ahead and smack the thumbs up um, as well. Smack the thumbs up as well, and um, yeah, that's that's about it for today. I, I got another couple of uh, videos that I'm going to be doing uh, throughout the holiday weekend. I got some extra time on my hands. I got nothing to do but laundry, and I'm smoking some meat as well on the smoker outside so you know I'm just gonna kick back and enjoy the holiday hope you guys do the same this is T.224 NYC Stream Kings TV hope you guys have a blessed weekend